Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I want to um, tell you something what happened. It was funny, but it was like stupid kind of funny because my mom's logic is stupidly funny, but not funny because things like this can be get you in a little bit more trouble than you want to have in trouble, you know. So I was I was driving and my mom didn't want to drive, so I drive for her, you know. So we went from mall, I think it was um I think it was Davy Boulevard we came from and we was driving back, right? And I guess she was like, Oh you're gonna go on the highway and I was like, No, I'm not going on the highway. It was the first and the last time I'm gonna go on the highway, you know. And I'll tell you why. The first time I actually went on the highway, it was crazy. It was like so many cars speeding, just like running in to the other lane and whatnot. And it was getting very scary because I almost saw a crash like in between my eyes, you know. So I was like, I'm not going back on the highway ever again. Highway is to me is high 95, you know, or 75, whatever highway it is. I'm never going back on there. I should never say never, you know, because you never know if I will go on there again, you know. So, I'm going to tell you, when we finished, came from Davy Boulevard, we went down and we saw a Walmart, right? So, she was like, oh, pull in there, turn, make a right, you know? And I was like, okay. And the, the light turned green, you know? And I was going around the corner. She's like, turn, turn, turn. I was like, I am turning. She's like, no, make, um, don't go straight, make all right, you know? And I was like, okay, I hear you, you know? And she was on her phone as well, and I was like, okay, I hear you. So I'm pulling into um, into a Walmart, right? And we we was waiting for a um, parking spot because it was all full, you know? And um, it was like this one car, I think it was like a, I don't know if it was a, a Lex, I think it was a Lexus or a Honda Civic or, I don't remember what it was. It must have been one of those little cheap cars, what everybody has, you know. Anywho, so I was waiting, and it was like a long line for waiting for one of these parking spots, right? And my mom's still on the phone at this point, and I'm looking for a parking spot because she don't like to be too far from the entrance, you know. And every time she kept telling me, park far from other people, right? But she don't take her own advice and park far from the other people you know or other cars you know so she likes to be close to the entrance you know so i'm trying to find a close entrance parking spot you know and i saw like a turn she was like oh turn here and i was like you can't turn there because other cars are coming this way and i'm going this way so it's not gonna go that way you know so i made a um i made a turn into a left hand side you know and I'm still looking for a parking spot, and I go around to the thing there, and lo and behold, I went kind of a little bit far from the entrance, like she don't want to be, you know? And I was like, yeah, it's still gonna be a parking spot, you know? You can still go in and out, you know? But anywho, I found, um, it was like a line, right? And it, I think they was waiting for a car, right? I think this person was just standing there, just waiting for something, to like a car coming out or something like that. I don't know, but, Somehow, I'm gonna show you a picture of how it was. Like this, guys. So, it was like a line right here, right? And all these cars was parked, you know, and signed for Walmart, you know. I'm gonna see if I can explain it best I can, you know, because when I was explaining it to my sister, she didn't get it, you know. So, I'm gonna explain it as best I can, you know. So we waiting in the line, right? And this fool right here, this imbecile, this creature, you know, is waiting for a parking spot. And this person right here is coming out of his parking spot, you know? And I found out he was waiting, you know? I found out my mom did it. This is my mom, this is me. And this is the person, this person right here is honking, you know? And this idiot, this fool, this imbecile is waiting for this person to get out, so. He's getting out, right? And I'm very close to him, you know? And this person is backing up, you know? Like, this close to hitting me, you know? And 
he's telling me to go um go around him right or go around that way you know and my mom is like oh is a parking spot opening right and this person is very far he was like up to here you know and i was right here and i could have got that parking spot you know and i didn't really want to get in that crash because this person was backing up on top of me you know and i was like this is not gonna work you know and i'm like I don't want to get in a crash. She's like, my mom was like, wait for him and make sure the parking spot is stable for us to go in, right? And I'm telling my mom that he's waiting for this parking spot and he's going to crash into me because some people don't care if you behind him or not, you know? And I guess this idiot, this fool, this imbecile was that kind of person, you know? So he's backing up on me and I'm getting shits, I'm getting shits scared, you know? Like, my brain is like not working at this point. So I'm thinking that to be a good person or a good citizen, you know, right? To go around him, right? So I'm trying to go around him as he's still backing up on me. I'm going around and my mom is yelling at me, why are you, why are you going to stay there? Why are you going to stay there? And we, I'm pulling off still, you know? And this idiot is getting this parking spot right here. This is the parking spot he's getting right here. He's getting this parking spot. And my mom was like yelling at me like, why you didn't stay there? If he hits you, he hits you. We're gonna um, we're gonna call the police and everything, you know? And I'm like, mother, I'm not trying to get in a car crash. She's like, why you didn't stay there? And all these little stuff and just chewing me out left to right, you know? And I'm like, I'm not getting in an accident. And she's like, this is how you got in the last accident. I was like, no, scratch that. I didn't get in a car accident. I actually did, but this fat, ugly, jalopy ass bitch crashed into me so it was not my fault it was this bitch's fault you know so i was like i was like why is she bringing up old things you know old past um crashes you know and that was my first crash you know and she was like bringing that up and i'm still looking for a parking spot at this point so i go around the corner finally found a parking spot right right next to you know the little where it says like um plant and dirt you know like the the guarding um section you know for the Walmart, I went over there and parked. She's like, "Why well, you didn't park there? We're too close. We're too far from the um, entrance and all these other stuff." And then she's yelling at me, and she's still on the phone. And I'm like, "Why are you yelling at me? I did a good thing. You should be patting me on my back, like good job, daughter. You know." But no, she was just chewing me out left to right, you know. And that is how she wanted me to get in another accident. I feel say she was trying to give me an accident because she was telling me, stay right there, and if he crashes into you, he's gonna go to jail or some kind of thing. I don't know why, what kind of logic that was to her in her mind that if we get in a crash, what if that person don't even have insurance? The last time I brought him crashed into someone, they didn't have insurance. So I had to pay for my damages myself, you know? And it was not even my car. It was some random person who she let um, us borrow his car. Actually, we already had a car. He was just like cleaning our car and he wanted to switch cars as he was cleaning our car. And I crashed that car, you know? So like in the sky, turn your notification on and bye. Oh yeah, welcome back to my channel.